Daytona Beach. It's bike week, it's also spring break, so a lot of activity is going on right now. However, we found something that is sensational here at the Daytona Flea Market. So stay tuned and after our introductory video, we're going to show you exactly what we're talking about. So we're here at Soap Happy Soap People, and this is Bambi and her husband Scott, and this is a family uh, business. Uh, they, this couple owns the business, but family actually helps and makes each and every bar, each oil, and ev all the products that they have here. So very fascinating. Bambi, tell me a little bit about how you kind of got started. Oh, um, so I got started because I have super sensitive skin. And I actually, it was through a friend of mine who introduced me to a product that I, I started using, um, but then using it in realization at the time, understood that it was something that I could um, kind of do on my own. So once I understood that essential oils are um, extremely beneficial to the body and that we could make our own products, um, after that, all bets were off and here we are eight, nine years later. Wow, so the business has gone well. Yes, very well. We, um, we're here in the Daytona Flea Market, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, each week from 9.30 to approximately 4, a little later sometimes. Um, also, we do an online, which right now is shut down um, only because the platform is having some difficulties, but you can always reach out to us on Facebook, Soap Happy Soap People. Um, but yeah, every, everything's been going fantastic. Uh, we have a wonderful following. A lot of our uh, uh, customers have become family. Um, we're extremely family oriented and we're not just here to sell products. Um, our heart is to love on people and to create a joyful atmosphere. So whether you're here to talk to us or purchase from us, we just were here with open arms and I think that has a lot to do with um, our journey in becoming good at what we're doing. That is very cool. So tell me a little bit about the soaps. I know you use a lot of essential oils in the soaps uh, because they are not only good for the skin, good for the body. What are your categories of soaps that you have? So we have some that are specifically designed that we, um, we offer that are for the face specifically. So this is our milk and collagen. Collagen is very good for the skin, um, especially when it comes to our face because obviously our face is the first thing that people look at. So we wanna keep that, um, <laughs> as beautiful as possible, but as healthy as possible. So um, milk and collagen is one of our, our, our best sellers for the face. However, the turmeric, honey, and orange is amazing on the face. It's amazing for the full body, but the face, um, the turmeric is a natural anti-inflammatory. And then also we have the uh, aloe calendula, aloe calendula, calendula again, natural anti-inflammatory. Um, there's a lot of people who are gravitating towards goat milk these days, and um, and I don't personally I don't see where goat's milk ha has any greater benefit than let's say the shea butter, um, because they both ultimately do the same thing. But there's a preference there, and so whatever your preference is, we got you covered. Um, so unscented goat's milk is always always stocked up, as well as the uh, oatmeal. Um, and those ones there are the ones that we kind of dedicate to the face, unless of course you're having an acne issue, and there's various types of acne. Um, a lot of the face and body acnes that um, teens face or even just young adults, we always recommend the unscented activated charcoal. Our activated charcoal does not have any other ingredients um, aside of anything natural. Um, the ones that you purchase commercially, they are going to have additives and they're gonna rename them so you don't really understand it. But just understand if it says anything more than something you can eat, right down to the activated charcoal, don't buy it. So natural is natural and that's natural. So a lot of the things commercially made, made in mass quantities are not gonna be natural because they have to pro provide to the larger masses. I know you have a thieves blend soap that has a, a, a mixture of the essential oils. Absolutely. Tell us about that one. Okay, so this is our best defense and it is made with the, uh, the Thieves Blend oil. Um, so if you're familiar with Thieves Blend, you know it's comprised of several different oils. I won't run down them now. You can actually do the research online. It's very available. But the Thieves Oil Blend comes from a, uh, a very long history ago, way before all of our time. Um, 
but it is an antibacterial, antifungal, and an anti antiviral, yes. So it's an all-around wonderful bar of soap. Um, this is one of our best sellers. Um, it's very beautiful, so it does sit nice sitting on your sink or shower tub. Which is nice, especially if somebody is sick, you know, or exactly. if they've been around a lot of people and they just want to yeah, just get rid of that kind of stuff, sure. we exactly. have something available. Let's move on to some of the other products you have, like sure. your oils and your creams. What are your top sellers with your facial products, your scrubs, okay, things so, like that? So with our um, sugar scrubs, I do one specifically that is actually geared to the face, and that is our turmeric, honey, and orange, which pairs really good with our soap. So um, these are dedicated for face. Um, this is all over body sugar scrub, but wonderful on the face as well. Most of our sugar scrubs I don't recommend for the face. This one I do, along with our oatmeal, milk, and honey. Um, this lotion is an oatmeal, milk, and honey. It's an all over body lotion. You can't go wrong. Um, the smell is t just absolutely divine. And the same with our love spell. So love spell is actually an old creation. Um, and it's it's absolutely wonderful. This is our sugar scrub. Um, I also call it our body polish because it gives you a shine that um, you're not going to get with just soap and water and even lotion. So this will shine your skin and nourish your skin with the oils that we use. Um, but we have several different varieties of, of scents. Very nice. So if you use, if we take that and then we pair it with some of your body oils, sure. that just would layer the scent so then it would actually last all day, correct? Absolutely. So tell us a little bit about your body oils. So the body oils are blends. Um, so these are just the little roller bottles of the blends, but we offer only a few right now. I'm actually in the process of working with different oils and creating newer blends that people are requesting. But right now we offer the most common, which is Love Spell and Angel and Wildflower. And, and absolutely, we offer them in the two ounce sprays as well. So um, a lot of people like those because they're lightweight oils. They aren't heavy on the body. They don't make you sweat. They just give you a nice shine. And because they're all natural, they're not putting, they're not impeding your skin with um, chemicals or anything of that nature. They're natural. So you don't have to worry about sweating and having it going deep into your pores um, and harming the inside of you. Because obviously what goes on you goes in you at some point. So using the all natural products, best way to go. Oils, all natural. Um, a great replacement for perfumes if, if necessary. And what about your um, different balms for your lips? Oh yeah, I do these. These are actually, these could be different flavors any day of the week, um, but they are all natural. We do use a beeswax, ba beeswax base, um, but I mean, right now, this one is the pomegranate and uh, pear, um, and I have guave in there, but they're just normal, all natural beeswax base uh, lip balms, and they're great for a lot of different people. I'm um, a lot of patients actually people will buy them for their family members who may be sick because um, they get dry lips from medications and things of that nature so these are really good for that um, as well as just everyday use for everyone and what about your beard oils i hear that you have some really <laughs> nice beard oils we sure do so our beard oils are very popular here in daytona beach um, especially during bike week um, but we use a premium oil blend and it's created with a hemp oil we have a variety of different scents. I make different ones different times of the year, so I kind of like to do these a little bit seasonal. Um, but right now we're offering the Deep Forest, Frankincense and Myrrh, Nag Champa. Um, we also have a Tobacco Jack, which comes from the Tobacco Flower, which is a huge hit. Um, and then we have Sandalwood yep, yep. Bourbon, Antique Sandalwood, Lemongrass, which a lot of men like if they're camping. Um, a lot of our tourists here are outdoors. So I know you also have some specific products for feminine care. Yeah, we offer some um, pH balance products for women because we're, you know, we're delicate. So um, in that, we, we like to kind of uh, just sort of focus on our pH balancing. Whereas these soaps are all wonderful. You can use them anywhere, however, just to kind of create an environment that's necessary for ladies. We do offer a few different glycerin-based soaps. Um, we have rosemary. Um, we also have a daisy and a rose. And this one here is our apple cider vinegar. This is apple cider, apple, apple cider. We also do a basil. And then this is just for bacterial purposes. It helps to keep things um, in check as well as a steam and then just a moisturizer. So ladies, we have you covered as well for your specific needs. Um, this 
these products here are geared towards women who um, just want to maintain their current healthy balance but they're also wonderful for getting you back to good if you go through any kind of medical issues or anything of that nature. We have the loofah bags, which uh, these are a little bit, these are a, uh, a hemp bag, a little bit softer texture, and uh, the bar soap fits right inside it. You use it right inside there, preserves the soap, and hang it up when you're done. And we also have the loofah bag, which is a little bit more scrubbing, for like the uh, rougher areas, take the skin off, helps remove the dead skin. And that also, you put your soap right inside there. I like to uh, just cut my bar in half and stick it right in there. And it helps preserve the soap even longer. What I have to say, when it comes to these loofah bags, I really enjoy it because uh, I've, I'm actually using it. And it was the best decision that my wife made for me. Awesome. And you're not going to be disappointed about it because we know that the stuff, it'll smell the whole place. And it's amazing. Hours. Ma amazing. Yeah. Day, I'll go ahead and smell, smell it. Just smell it. Wow. Oh, for sure. Yeah. So. Like my personal one is the frankincense and myrrh. Oh, I love the frankincense and myrrh. It's a nice, relaxing, a lot of benefits to it. Uh, the fragrance is amazing. And you know what? I'm yeah. going to tell you, we're yeah. guys. Yeah. So, listen, I love smelling presentable. Sure. Who, so, it yeah. doesn't you don't have, it's not a girly stuff. No, no. You know, this is a manly stuff that we're talking about. That's right. And the smell. A little bit of mountain man pine. Exactly. So, you guys need to come and try it out. Okay, yes. Scott, so now that we have reviewed all the wonderful products you guys have, where can yes. we go to purchase them? So, you can go right to the Daytona flea market uh, we're right at the end of sea south entrance on the south end of the parking lot uh, and you can find us also on our facebook page so happy so people and they can purchase there and they can purchase there yes. oh wonderful yes. okay yep. well yep. thank you so much all right